unbelievable clearance items at Costco. While everyone was talking about the 151 clearance in the States, here in Canada, we've had another clearance item and it's the three pack with the two Pokeballs and the ETB. I couldn't believe it when I saw the price, $49.95. And if you actually translate that to American, that's like $35 for this. This is insane. Yeah, I still can't believe that this three pack here was $49.97 Canadian. That's basically what you'd pay at like any card shop just for this on its own and you're getting two Pokeballs as well. So 15 packs for $49.97 right there as you guys can see. Look at that, Pokemon ETB, $49.97 Canadian. So if you guys are watching in the States, that's essentially like $34 American for two Pokeballs plus the ETB. That's an insane deal. So here it is, super happy to grab this. I left a bunch of them there because I didn't really want to like buy a bunch if there's any kids who wanted to grab some Pokemon sets. Uh, you know, for a deal like this, I feel like it's going to entice a lot of scalpers to buy a bunch of these and sit on them. And I definitely didn't want that to happen. So I just bought one and uh, hopefully some other kids and stuff can actually get to it because that was an insane deal. I still can't believe it. I think these are normally supposed to be like $74 or $79 Canadian at Costco, which is still an okay deal, but uh, for $49.95, I'll buy these all day. So let's see what we got here. So we have the two Pokeballs on the side, as you can see, and the ETB with me in the reflection. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> you can see right there. All right, so let me slice into this and then we'll take a look. Okay, so here is our beautiful ETB and then we also have the two Pokeballs here and I know that these codes at the bottom actually indicate what you might be getting on the inside and these are D23 so I think these are the ones that have the two lost origin packs and then you also get I believe one silver tempest in each so uh, why don't we open these up last since uh, it's more of a variety and then we'll just get to the scarlet and violet packs right here so let's slice this open and let's take a closer look at the inside. And of course you get your binoculars, so let's just take a look at the neighbors here. Not looking too good. And of course you get your beautiful booster packs on the inside here, nine scarlet and violet packs. And then also you get your goodies, like your dividers, your energies. You also get your coins, your dice, and your beautiful sleeves there with the code card. But probably my favorite thing that they put in the ETBs right now is the beautiful exclusive promos. So really happy to grab this one. I think I already have this in my collection though, since I, I opened both ETBs, I believe, on the channel uh, from Scarlet and Violet. Okay, Gyarados pack first. Wish me luck, guys. Hope I get something good. I don't have good luck with Scarlet and Violet. I have better luck with Paldea and uh, actually Obsidian Flames not really either. Really, it's just Paldea Evolved is the only set that I've had really good luck with. So let's see, I'm not starting off well here either. Well, as I say that, uh, yeah, it's not looking good. It's not looking good at all, but hopefully we get something here. Pokeball, okay, let's see what our first foil here is. Potion with the Riolu, and then there you go, Ride on EX, not bad, that is a hit. Very that nice. is a hit, we'll put it right at the back there, code card as well. Let me know, what's your favorite set from the Scarlet and Violet era? I, I'm torn, um, I, you know, the, the Kanto kid in me, I guess, says 151, but uh, my heart saying Paldea Evolve is my favorite, but I don't know, let me know yours down below in the description. Um, I, Paradox Rift I wasn't a huge fan of, wasn't actually a huge fan of Scarlet and Violet, if I'm uh, being quite honest either. But, um, you know, you win some, you lose some here. And unfortunately, these are the ETBs that are attached uh, to this little three box set here. It'd be cool if there was something uh, else, like Paldea would have been great. Or maybe an ETB for 151. Well, that would have been crazy. I know in Costco, uh, at the States, they had that deal. It was like $36 or something like that. And you had the, uh, the two box sets. It was Alexam and Zapdos. That's a pretty wild deal. Uh, we haven't seen that yet at Costco here in Canada, but I don't go too much. Like I literally only go. I need some bulk or like some bulk stuff, uh, stuff that's went out. We went recently, and I found this because we actually were out of toilet paper and uh, like uh, paper towels. So it was mostly just to grab that. And obviously, I grabbed a Costco hot dog, and I also saw that great Pokemon deal. So I couldn't resist. I had to get it. Magneton. Oh boy, Don Dozo. Yikes. Okay, so so far we have three packs left and we only have the one hit, which is Ride on EX. Kind of shocking here. But again, I said before, my luck with Scarlet and Violet's pretty bad. So it's not really surprising me. Holy cow, what is going on here? There's no way I'm only getting one hit from this ETB. If that's the case, holy crap, this is horrible. This is just awful, awful. Like, oh, let me say that. What's going on? Oh my god. 
As we were saying that, we literally get the chase card of the entire set. I, was just tra I guess that's what happens. You trash the set and you get the best card in it. That's how it works. Unbelievable. I can't believe we just got this. This is actually insane. Oh my God. Where are my sleeves? It's so funny because I was actually just thinking about this card too. And I was like, well, even before the video, I was thinking to myself, like, what was the big chase card again? It was like, it was a trainer that started with an M. I, I, it just slipped my mind. And I was like, I feel like I'm going to pull that today. And there we go. We did Miriam there. Beautiful. Now we have the Iono alternate art from how they evolved and the Miriam. Holy cow. We're going to set that right in the back there. That's definitely getting a top loader after the video. That is wild. Then we just get the regular Maridon now. Wow, Maridon's bringing the luck here, clearly, with the foil, the EX, and then we also get the Miriam on top of that with the, with the Maridon pack. Holy cow, this is wild. All right, let's keep it going here. I'm actually really excited now. That pull basically almost paid for the entire thing. Actually, it might have paid for the entire thing if you convert it to American prices. Houndstone, there we go. Nice, beautiful there. Look at that. Oh, my God. Bombardier. Um, how do you say that? Bombardier. Jeez. Okay, first time pulling that one as well. Beautiful card. And then we have Slowbro on top of that with uh, very nice artwork. And there is the code card. Now we're going to open the two balls. That sounded weird. I said two balls. Okay, here we go. Let's see what's on the inside. I do know from what I've seen based on some videos that it's, I don't know if this is with all Costco tins, but the Silver Tempest in these Costco tins is, is like insane. It's almost like a guaranteed uh, ultra rare. I don't know if that's actually going to happen to me though. Um, if we do have Scar Silver Tempest, but we'll definitely take a look because we have two potential Silver Tempest packs. Uh, and if we have Ultra Rares in both, then I I'm saying it. I'm saying you get the good hits in Silver Tempest here for these Costco tins. Okay, so let's see what our beautiful coin is. Ooh, we got the Pikachu. I thought we might have been getting the Eevee, but I'll take that. Nice Pikachu here. And then, yes, I was right. It's the Lost Origin and then the Silver Tempest pack as well. Okay, let's do it. Lost Origin. Still haven't pulled that Giratina. That'd be insane if that actually happens today. Uh, I don't want to spoil a code card. There's the code card for you guys to redeem. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. Bring it back to the front. Here we go. Electric Energy. Lost City. Come on. Thornton. Shuppet. Machop. Pikachu. Phantom. Sudowoodoo. Snowbird. And Electros. Ooh. Yeah, I haven't seen a lot of good pulls from the uh, Lost Origin packs in the Costco tins usually all in the uh, Silver Tempest ones. There you go. Code card for you guys. And uh, what am I doing? I already did the code. What am I doing? One, two, three, four. Bring it back to the front, Matt. What's going on? Okay, V-Star Marker. Let's go straight to the foil toolbox and Dugong. Dugong, you're wrong. That was a bad pack. Bad pack. Yeah, here we go. So if we get an ultra rare in this, and I know there's something going on with these tins. Okay, here we go. Code card for you guys. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. Show us something more. Psychic Energy, Dragonair. Oh boy, here we go. Dratini as well in the same pack. Phoebus, Fampy, Litten. Uh, nope, never mind. Okay. Well, we completely struck out on that tin, and it definitely blows that conspiracy that I had in my mind right now with Silver Tempest packs from Costco. Maybe that's only in the States. Here in Canada, I don't know if we have that one. But right, here we go. Next tin here. Oh boy, that, that was brutal. Well, at least we got the Miriam, I, I have to say. I'm happy about that. But uh, this, that last tin was horrible. We completely struck out there. Oh, there we go. All right, do we have another coin here? Yes, we do. We got the Eevee coin. There we go. Happy to get that one. And the two Lost Origin with the one Silver Tempest. Okay, come on. We have to get at least one hit, right? Come on. We have to get one hit from these packs. And why did I? Okay. I don't know why I opened it like that. There you guys go. Well, we know we don't really have anything here, but we do actually know, okay, we got a Radiant card, Radiant Gardevoir. Okay, we'll put that at the back. Very and nice. uh, that is it. Okay, let's not do that again, Matthew. Unbelievable. <laughs> Just hanging around. And I did it again. And I did it again. Why are these back, I feel like they're backwards or something. Why, why did, I don't know, whatever. Okay, let's go. We have a Radiant card here? No, we don't. Okay. That was fun. Sorry for ruining the opening here. Wow, these are opening so bizarre. Okay, uh, here we go. Code card for you guys. One, two, three, four. Come on. Give us one hit for Christ's sake in this video. Oh, ooh, do you guys see that? That might be a silver border here. Oh my God, Serena, here we go. Oh boy, I think it's a trainer. I think it's a trainer or a regular full art. I think it's a trainer though. Spinarak, here we go. Ralts. 
Let's end this video good. Ooh, we got the judge. Not bad. I, th I said I thought it was a trainer and we were correct. There you go. Not bad. Ooh, and we got the foil dragon bolt there. Nice. Okay, so let's just quickly go over the hits uh, before we end off this video. We got the judge. We got Radiant Gardevoir. We have Bon Bird here. And then we have the Miriam, which is definitely the hit in the video. And then Mariodon EX as well. Not bad. You know, 15 packs in total. And we got five hits. That's one in three. I'll take that. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video.